You know, school may be ending for the year for most students across Idaho this week. Most school boards, though, don't get a summer break. Earlier this week, West Ada School District Board of Trustees met to go over a number of issues, including a policy some are calling controversial, which is ironic because it deals with controversial topics. The so-called policy 401.20, an attempt to bring the district in compliance with House Bill 377. It would stop teachers from asking students about their religious or political beliefs, their sexual orientation, their gender identity, race or ethnicity, and a few other things thrown in there without getting permission to ask these questions from their administration. And if approved, the policy would also prevent teachers from using any images that symbolize or depict, quote, political, quasi-political, or controversial topics in their classrooms. That means posters, stickers, signs, anything they put on the wall, you know, things of that nature to kind of make their classroom you know, feel more personal. What would be considered political, quasi-political, or controversial? Well, that wasn't made clear. The board was told some parents expressed concerns about the nature of questionnaires being given to their kids, a tool a lot of teachers use to get to know their students, you know, like if they have a nickname or something or, or whatever. The concern seemed to be the questions of a personal nature, but they didn't get into specifics of what those might be. As far as the signs, the flags, and other paraphernalia, well, apparently some parents worried whether those things made it difficult to provide a neutral environment or, or for discussion and for learning. All who spoke at that meeting, though, not in favor. Policy is a reflection of values, and I want West Data to confidently value inclusivity and diversity and not bend to pressure, groups, pressure from groups of people who don't understand that inclusivity is truly inclusive. It's a slippery slope to include any, quote, controversial topic as prohibited from visual display in the classroom. Ironically, this would be harmful to transgender students because it is very important that any person be referred to and treated in a fashion that they want to be. What is most disturbing is who will decide what is permissible, not permissible, as a political, quasi-political, or controversial topic. This sounds like it's micromanaging rather than empowering discussions with students about their world. Micromanaging in the country's least regulated state. Who decides what falls under controversial, by the way? That was just one of the proposed, uh, re this was the first reading, I should say, of this proposed policy. But that question of who decides what is controversial, that didn't get decided. Neither did this policy. No action was taken. Dr. Bubb, though, the district superintendent, says the policy will be sent to district staff, including teachers. He wants to get their input on it. The decision will come at a later board meeting.